Hello mi gente, what's up? It's your girl Nikki Sparks. So today I'm going to relax my hair. I'm going to relax my hair, that's why I have the camera and the and the stuff set up in the back. So um, I think I forgot to count how many months that I I haven't relaxed my hair. Um, but I think the last time I relaxed it was in June. If I remember June or July, so August, September, October, three months. Um, I usually just relax my hair every three months, and sometimes when I have the courage and and, and the patience, I go for five months. Um, but right now I need to relax it because in the back right here, I think I've been using castor oil nonstop in my scalp here in the back. I've been having a little setback. So I have a lot of new growth in the back and I need to relax it ASAP because I don't want my hair to break. So yeah, let's get started. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> yeah, let's This is the relaxer that I'm going to be using. It's the Olive Oil ORS relaxer in medium. And this is what it comes with, with the replenishing conditioner. This box came with a exotic oil booster with gloves, the wooden stick, all the, all the good stuff that comes with the relaxer. So here I am adding the activator into the cream to mix it. And I'm going to start to mix it there now with a wooden spatula. You have to mix it well for about one minute, one or two minutes, not more. So this this box came with a exotic oil booster. So right after I mix the activator, I'm going to add in the oil. You're gonna see me do that just now. this so they said it's actually an oil that's going to boost and protect your hair boost the shine and protect your hair this is these are little little braid that I, that I did the night before I always moisturize and seal the night before I relax my hair so as I was saying at the beginning at the intro I have a lot of new growth so that's why I'm parting my hair that way. I usually do just four, four parts, two in the back, two in the front. And I'm starting with the middle because it's there I have the most hair growth. I usually never go this high, but I have, I have new growth from the last time I relaxed my hair there in the middle so I'm kind of like doing a recovery relax or two like relaxing where wasn't relaxed properly the last time so this is why I'm going this low with the relaxer not all the way to my ends but halfway and it's the only piece that I'm gonna be doing that because it's the only part of my hair that didn't actually get relaxed the best the last time so here with the with the dye uh, brush I'm just making trying not to add it onto my scalp too much and here I part the the, 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 the front part of my hair the edges part that's the last that's the last part of my hair that I relax because it's the thinnest I always had my front hair thin even when I had natural hair it's not because I relax my hair that my edges are thin I always had it like that and it's something that doesn't bother me so yeah so I'm repeating the same process in front to make sure I'm coating the new growth
then I go over a second time and here I'm going to smooth I'm going to smooth my hair with the comb and comb it through to make sure that it's relaxed properly this time Run it with a comb and know it doesn't break your hair if you do it properly so don't worry and then on the rest of my hair I'm just going to repeat the same process then I'm going to rinse it off and I'm going to dye my hair with water non-permanent dye the last the first video I did while I relaxed my hair a lot of people was like oh my gosh she's gonna be bald because she's dyeing her hair the same day that she's relaxing her hair listen if you knew what you was talking about you would know that the bottle dyes the dyes that are not permanent dye do not damage your hair uh, we've been doing this uh, Dominican woman been doing this for years and years and years and they have long hair healthy long relaxed hair I've been doing it too my hair never broke out anyways of so I have a video where I show you guys how I do my roller set and blow dry my hair so don't hesitate to check it out so this is the setback that I'm talking about right here in the middle I think it's because I've been doing too much high buns uh, too much high buns tight or I don't know but I have a little setback so I'm about to cut my hair because I don't like to see that I wasn't going to cut it then I was like listen cut it because then your hair is going to get damaged even more I mean my ends so this is what I'm doing I'm cutting it it's just hair it will grow back I have a good hair I take care of my hair good i do natural remedies to grow hair check out my video about that as well and i take good care of my hair you're gonna see that's the only part that looks unhealthy and that's why i've been using a lot of castor oil in the back because i think i've been neglecting that part of my hair anyhow so i'm cutting my hair here i'm just checking to see if it's straight enough and it isn't so i'm going back in with the scissors i'm not a professional i'm just using my brains and what i think i can do <laughs> yeah so um cutting so i'm just gonna let you guys watch i don't have much to explain here i think it's self-explanatory don't cut your head don't try to cut your hair if you have no idea of what you're doing always go to a professional don't damage your hair don't damage your hair if you have no idea of what you're doing the hiccups <laughs> so i'm all done as you can see it's properly cut i cut it good my hair now my oh gosh now my hair looks healthy and good to go to start journey 
not to start but to keep on with my hair journey and now I'm going to take more care of my back middle part of my hair let me know what you think if I did a good job I think I did great sorry for the hiccup so yeah this is how the hair came out and I'm loving it I'm loving it I'm feeling myself mm -hmm. yes girl yes hunty <laughs> Here I'm, I'm curling it a little bit to do like a nice bang, hair bang, like this, like. So here I'm going to do my tubi, the wrap in, in Spanish and Dominican and Dominican Republic we say tubi. Some they say tubi, others say tu dubi. I just call it say tubi. Um so yeah. Thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate the support, the ones who watch my videos i really appreciate you guys give this video a thumbs up if you're new here consider subscribing and to my subscribers do not forget to do not forget to click on the notification bell because youtube don't always show the, the small youtubers videos like that Thank you. Bye.